love Lexington. I think it's a perfect location. It definitely has the southern hospitality while also having a lot of things to do. This is a super exciting time to be in Lexington. I just really like Lexington's feel. There's so much to do. There's just so many different things that Lexington has to offer. It's a great mix of being homey enough, but also the city, so you can enjoy the city life and the culture that comes along with it. There's always um, something related to the arts. You're right by Rupp Arena, you're right by Triangle Park. My friends and I like to just walk around downtown and go visit all the little shops and the restaurants. I love just all the local things, all the local restaurants. There's a lot of great places to go eat here. I'm not working, I'm eating. <laughs> there are so many neat hidden gems popping up around town. I found little nooks and crannies within Lexington that I didn't know existed at first. I feel like Lexington is really cool to explore. The distillery district is a great place for people even under 21. You know, Lexington it has this great downtown area, which is perfect, and it makes you feel like you're in the city. But then, you know, just drive a few miles out, and you feel like you're in this small town, in this, this great area. And you're also a 10-minute drive from the Rolling Hills and everything, by the horse farms, and 10-minute drive from Keeneland. Keeneland is really nice. I've gone once, and I loved it, and I want to go to Keeneland more. There is the Arboretum as well, which is this area of just rolling hills, green grass, beautiful flowers. It's a great place to kind of go to if you are wanting to kind of escape the city. So if you come from a small town, Lexington is not too big for you, to where you um, feel lost. But if you come from a big city, Lexington's not too small, to where you feel like there's nothing to do. You kind of get the best of both worlds. It's great being in a town that is so welcoming. Everyone's really kind. You feel at home here.